Hi, it's nice to see you again. Thanks for joining me. It's Janice, author of Unlock Your Voice, The Secrets to Singing, and head vocal coach of Life Academy. Today, I'm going to talk about how you can sing those low notes with more power, with more resonance. All right? It's easy. Just apply these three steps. Step number one. Use the right vocal register. Now, all of us have four vocal registers, and they are the chest voice, there's also the mix or the middle voice, and the head voice, and the whistle register. Now, you don't have to use all of this when you want to sing those low notes. In fact, the one that you should be focusing on is the chest register. Now, how do you feel or know that you're singing in this chest register? It's easy. If you just try this with me, Ah, and put your hand, your palm, right here, okay? You should feel like the resonance or the vibration is happening a lot around this area here. So let's try that. Ah, ah, ah. Now, if you don't feel much here, instead you're feeling the vibration very much here or just here, then you're not really singing in your lowest register yet, the chest voice. So let's try that a couple times. Hey, hey, speaking in, ah, like that, all right? Once you get the hang of it, Try to control yourself, you know, control the resonance and make sure when you're singing those low notes, those low notes feel as if they're coming from here, all right? So that's the first step. Second step is to watch your larynx, all right? You want to make sure that your larynx is somewhat neutral and not dipped too low. It is natural for us when we sing lower notes or speak in a lower tone for the larynx to drop lower. You don't want it to go too low. For example, this is when the larynx is going low. Now, if you're wondering what the larynx is, it's basically your Adam's apple, okay? Your voice box. So, just looking at this, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, this is me lowering my larynx on purpose, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. So, you can see that going down. Now, um, on thinner people, it's more obvious. On, um, you know, not so thin people, it's not so obvious. <laughs> so what you can do is you can use your hand and then just put it there. You can feel it going down as well if you can't see it. So, uh, uh. Now, when you go for the low lower notes, just make sure that this is dipping only slightly. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Ah, ah, and you can hear the difference it makes. It doesn't sound so dopey. Uh, sounds very dopey, but without ah, uh, when it's neutral, it sounds much clearer. And if you were to try it on a song like um, I Try by Macy Gray, right? Games, changes, and fears. When will they go from here? Here. Instead of here, here, which will not help you get there, right? So watch your larynx. Third thing to watch out for is ding, ding, ding. make sure you focus on the vowels, all right? So for a word such as here, you want to ear, ear, speak it clearly and sing it clearly, ear, like that, instead of getting yourself stuck in a position where you are singing with a vocal fry. Vocal fry sounds something like this, ear, 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 where will they go from here? When will they stop? This does not help your voice get to the front of your mask. And it will be really hard to get loud like that. Yeah, where will they stop? So instead, yeah, yeah, when will they stop? Up, up, like that. All right, and just to show you what I mean. Games, changes, and fears. When will they go from here? When will they stop? Instead of, Games, changes, and fears When will they go from here? When will they stop? The second one is vocal fry, so try not to do that by focusing on the vowels. So apply these three steps and you'll be on your way to singing those low notes with more power, with more resonance. So for more vocal tips, remember to stay tuned and I will be dropping one as soon as this weekend. All right, until then, have fun singing. And if you want more videos also, you can just drop your email at unlockyourvoice.com.my. Take care.